Let's talk about tally charts because you're going to be creating a tally chart using information you'll be gathering this week. So first of all, what is a tally chart and when would you use it? A tally chart is a table used to record information about a set of people or things. So you've got a group of people or a group of things. And if you're gathering information about them, often a tally chart is a good way to record information about how many of different characteristics or traits or opinions or whatever it is there are. One tally mark is used to mean an amount of one. And tally marks are usually grouped in sets of five. When would you use a tally chart? It's especially useful when we're counting data quickly. So if you're recording it and you need to quickly be able to record, oh, there's another one of this, or I have another one of this, you can quickly make a line to show there's another one. Why do we strike through every group of five? So that's important with tallies. You would do four, and then for the next one, you do a diagonal strike through. The reason we do that is to make it easy to count up the data. So if I'm looking at a big group of numbers, it's way easier for me to, to count by fives, five, 10, 15, 20, or you can even see um, that two groups of tallies are 10. That makes it way easier than counting by one, um, a big group of tallies. A tally graph should have a title, columns and rows labeled, and every fifth data point is a diagonal strike, just like we talked about. That makes it easy to see how many there are. So let's look at this example. Here we've got a tally chart, and I want you to try to figure out how many weeks had four days of rain. So pause, figure that out, and then you can play to find out the answer. So if you said 19 weeks had four days of rain, you are correct. Let's look at one more question. How many robins were seen on Tuesday? So use this tally chart to find out how many robins were seen on Tuesday. If you thought it was two robins, you are correct. So hopefully you're ready now to make your own tally chart. Bye, grade twos.